hello guys and welcome to our channel as you can see today i'm alone my sister redina is not with me and this is because i am filming a quite special video which i do best i think Today I'm filming a perfume video and because Redina is not as much into perfumes as I am she was like you know what if you want to film a perfume video just film it yourself so here am I and whoever is new here my name is Ramona and please make sure to hit that red button down there and subscribe to the channel hit that notification bell to get notified whenever I or we with my sister we post videos and please put a big like on the video so today I'm gonna review a dupe perfume for alien so i'm sure you have heard of alien of thierry mugler i think i pronounced the name correct mugler or mugla anyway apologies if i don't this is one of my oh my god i love this one oh, this is one of my favorite perfumes whenever it runs out i always must purchase it it is um jasmine flower scent it is quite strong and oriental let's say kind of vibes and if you are not too much into strong perfumes i'm not sure how much you're gonna like this one but it is a signature scent of lots of people and it's not as unique as it should be in my opinion but still it's it's amazing and today i am going to review a dupe for it this is the one so this is actually 489 by Federico Mahora. So, before I start doing this review, let me just tell you guys something. I was actually reading about perfumes and I saw this brand, Federico Mahora, also known as FM Group. They do dupes for designer expensive perfumes and they number the perfumes with this uh, number. The packaging is very simple. It kind of reminds me of the Jo Malone packaging because they do have like very simple packaging as well. So yeah, it's not a very, very hard brand, this um, Federico Mahora, but yeah, they do dupes. They do dupes for everything. They do dupes for expensive and super expensive perfumes. So this one for eight nine is a dupe for Alien by Thierry Mugler. But they also have dupe for um, very expensive perfumes, such as uh, the one of Baccarat Rouge by Francis Cortijan. They do have um, also dupes for Tom Ford, dupes for Chanel, and blah, blah, blah. So they have a lot of dupes. And I was like, I'm just going to purchase it and see if, if it's a good dupe. Because if it's good, I'm just going to wear it at home, you know, and don't spray the expensive one at home. So yeah, let me just tell you the prices. This was £16, £15.99 to be exact. And because I was a little bit skeptical first um, about the brand, I was like, shall I purchase it on their website? Yes, no. I was like, is it a scam? You know, all this kind of stuff. And I was like, you know what? Because it was available on Amazon, I was like, I'm just going to purchase it on Amazon because I always buy from there and I know that it's trustworthy, you guys know. So yeah, it came pretty quickly, it came in two working days, so yeah, and uh, here somewhere in the screen I would put, um, I'm going to put, sorry, the, um, the packaging, um, how it first came, so um, yeah, let's, uh, I have sprayed this before, and this video I'm just going to review it, and I'm going to tell you guys my honest, honest, honest opinion about it. So if it's really worth to buy it as a dupe for Alien, if you want to spend a uh, like, um, little bit of money, not as much money, because the Alien, if I'm not mistaken, is priced at £89, something like this. Lastly, the last time when I bought it, I purchased it at £89 at Boots. So, yeah. So, just um, something before I spray this one. It's a quite alcoholic perfume. Uh, so I don't quite like it to spray it on my skin because, um, I don't know, it's, it's quite alcoholic. So I spray it on clothes or in the air. So I'm just going to spray it in the air and see. <sighs> okay. Okay. Ah, oh, this smells good guys. Okay. You get the exact same vibe as Alien. 
let me spray alien on my arm okay is the exact exact same vibe as alien guys i'm actually speechless okay exact same vibe and please before i continue i just wanted to share out the notes of this perfume with you so the top notes of the alien perfume who whoever for whoever doesn't have it is um jasmine and um the heart notes of it is wood and the base note is amber so yes so, so let's get back to this Federico Mahora dupe 489 so as I told you guys I still can smell it it smells um pretty much I mean the same when you firstly spray it it smells the same as Alien by Curie Mugler but after like even now I feel like it dries down so much and you can smell like a very alcoholic scent cheap one which for me is rubbish like honestly I mean you do you do get the vibe 100% but after I'm just gonna spray it on my skin I feel like it's better it's fine yes 100% you do get the vibe of alien but does it last like now I feel like the vibe is absolutely not the same I don't even know how to express this pretty well now I can only uh, smell plastic artificial stuff oh, this was quite a disappointment so guys just to get this all together you do get the vibe of alien from this 489 perfume 100% but guys only for a couple of seconds only for a couple of seconds alien is well known for its long lasting scent i mean like guys it lasts for ages and it projects amazingly in the air everywhere so i feel like if you wear this one who whenever you go somewhere or like enter a room everyone can smell you let's say and i love that instead with this one they can smell you for a couple of seconds and after that's it after i feel like they can smell rubbish they can smell a really cheap 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 scent and no so was it worth it or is it worth it to purchase this one as a dupe of alien no sorry i don't recommend it not even to be worn at home i was like i'm quite skeptical skeptical sorry guys to spray it on on my skin because i know that it's quite um an alcoholic perfume but i was like if it's good i'll spray it on my clothes and just wear it at home but no this is just gonna go in the bin for me i'm not sure about the other perfumes from this brand the other tubes but i feel like it's pretty much the same so yeah this was a uh, quite a uh, disappointing purchase for me so be careful when you buy from this um brand because they do smell exactly like the original the first couple of seconds i'm not gonna lie but after the perfumes it dries down immediately and it smells like cheap plastic alcoholic scent it doesn't smell good at all it smells like you have spent i don't know uh, two or three pounds to buy like a scent out there and just spray it on yourself and of course we don't like that we hate that so yes i hope for you guys this video was helpful let me know in the comments below and yeah thank you so much for watching make sure to subscribe in the channel and i'm sure next time redina will film with me if she doesn't want to film perfumes i would be like please do film with me so yes thank you so much for watching and party